Hey guys, welcome back to Done With Depression. Today we're talking about my experience being on antidepressants after about a month. So originally the psychiatrist had me on Lexapro, which is a pretty standard one that they start you out with, and that didn't really work. I felt better for a little bit, and then I felt almost as bad as I did before, and I was on the max dose. So that was not a good thing. So they switched it up and put me on uh, Effexor, which is a different category of antidepressants, and it has been working great. I had to up my dose a little bit um, from the original dose that they gave me, but the original dose was like barely anything. So now I'm just about in the middle range, and it's been working pretty well so far. Um, one thing that I did notice is I have constant ear ringing, which is kind of a weird side effect. I don't know if that's on the list of side effects or not, but it's only there really if you notice it, and it's just hard when it's quiet because you notice it a lot more. So right before you go to bed, or if you're just in a room trying to read, or something like that. So ear ringing is really only the side effect that I have and since it's working pretty well I didn't want to try and change it up again in case I got a worse side effect from something else. So that brings me into my next point of it being scary when you're starting to feel better and that sounds weird because when you're depressed you want to feel better right but for me it's kind of a twisted way of thinking that if I'm feeling better I almost have further to fall next time. So I don't really have that self-confidence yet of knowing that I'm going to be better forever. And I think that's probably similar with a lot of other things that people go through. The first thing that comes to mind is like alcoholism for me. Um, you don't really know that you're not going to drink forever. You just have to not drink for that day. So... I guess it would be the same with depression. You don't know that you're not going to be depressed again, but you just want to be good for that day. So kind of twisted thinking that I have further to fall, but it's also very weird to wake up and not have constant negative thoughts in my head and to actually be able to do things that I like to do, which sounds kind of crazy as well, but for a long time, I was getting up and didn't want to do anything. And it was just a struggle to just get out of bed or to get to work. And I was just doing this routine because the routine was the only thing that kept me going. And if I got out of my routine, that's when I started feeling uncomfortable and having anxiety and that sort of thing. So I feel like I have further to fall now. And then it's also weird doing things that I like and having some happiness in my life. So I'm kind of trying to deal with that and just do things that I like to do and continue to do things that make me happy and live my best life and try not to focus on the depression, but just focus on what I'm doing today in the moment. Um, so that's what I got for you guys. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Anything about antidepressants or what medicine, if you have questions on Lexapro or ones that I've taken, I can try and answer them. I'm not a psychiatrist, but I can tell you my experience with whatever happened. Also, if you guys check the description, there's six months free Amazon Prime below there. So make sure you check that out and I'll see you guys next time.